right, I'm here at Denver Comic-Con with some amazing cosplayers running around, and I spotted a little fallout over here. What's your name, sir? Anders Albertson. I uh, run High Castle Props. Outstanding. Tell us a little bit about your cosplay today. Uh, my, my cosplay is the sole survivor from Fallout 4, the main character. Um, I sided with the Brotherhood of Steel, so I've got the Brotherhood Bomber Jack. Um, and I've got the uh, 10 millimeter pistol, 3D printed, and the uh, heavy combat armor uh, right arm I made out of EVA foam and fiberglass resin. That is very cool. Uh, no dog meat today, though, huh? No dog meat today. All right, we're here with some amazing Destiny cosplay. So tell us about your costumes. How did you make them? Well, most of the stuff is EVA foam. You can find tons of tutorials online. Um, it, we've actually posted a lot of photos online of our progress of what we've done. We, we need to take more, but you know, it's what happens. Uh, most of this stuff is EVA foam, uh, put together with like super glue, barge cement, and stuff like that. Um, her armor here. It's my pride and joy. I sculpted it out of monster clay, and then we uh, made molds out of silicone and then cast it in resin and spent forever painting it. That looks amazing. Good job. So why Destiny this year? Last year you guys were here uh, as Borderlands. You guys looked amazing. Uh, so why Destiny this year? Well, we're actually not very attached to the game, but she is, and we all like the look of the armor. So for once, it was actually costumes that we weren't emotionally attached to, but we still wanted to do it because they look awesome. You can't go wrong with Bungie. Oh, not at all. They have a great community and even better armor. Someone said Call of Duty? I think these guys did. How's your show going so far? Well, pretty good. These guys are in stealth mode, so I had to pull them out of the crowd. For Sorry to uh, interrupt you guys, but you look great. Tell us about your gear. Well, uh, this is the urban assault uniform of the ghost unit. Uh, my call sign is Reaper. This is call sign. Uh, our turn, sir. We are ghosts. We hunt the Federation. We're trying to take back our country. Uh, this here is the uh, longbow. It's a prototype sniper rifle. This is a standard M4 carbine. So yeah, sticking to the Federation. All right, well, in case you were looking to collect things at Denver Comic Con, no one knows more about collections than fans of Pokemon. Uh, are you guys excited for the new game, Pokemon Sun and Moon? All right, I want to know who's going to start with Sun or Moon. Go. Sun? Moon. Sun. Moon. Moon. Ah, tell me about your costumes. Um, what made you guys go with Pokemon today? Um, well, we wanted to do a group out, like, cosplay together, and I think we all just share an interest in Pokemon. <laughs> now, you made these Pokeballs. These are amazing. Tell us a little bit about those. Um, so, basically, I just found a pattern online, and I said, I'm going to make a Pokemon for all of my friends to use with these costumes. Uh, it took me a few days to make all of these. Uh, it was a process, but I feel like they turned out pretty well. They really did. You guys look great. So what are you most looking forward to at Denver Comic Con today? Definitely seeing all the people. That's my favorite part. <laughs> people watching is the best. 